I'm just going to give this Dyson V6 Fluffy a very brief test in this video. So I put down some dirt on this medium pile carpet. Um, not the sort of dirt you'd spill on a carpet, but it's just for demonstration purposes. But there are three differently sized particles. I've got some rolled oats, some rice, and some loose leaf tea. So I'm going to start on the normal setting, not maximum, just the regular setting, which gives the longer running time. Let's see how well it does. Right, let's get down and dirty and have a, a feel of the carpet now. I don't know if you'll be able to see on camera, probably not, but there are some particles left. I can see a few bits bouncing as I'm moving the pile. I can see some loose leaf tea. There's a grain of rice there. It's picked up the majority of the dirt though on this medium pile carpet. It's not a short pile carpet. There is quite a depth of pile to this one. I'll finish the job. I'll go over the area again, but this time I'll try it on maximum, see if we can remove the rest of the dirt. <laughs> Okay then, another close inspection. Now apart from one tiny particle that I've missed, or the Dyson's missed, two, I stand corrected, that's not done a bad job at all, especially for a cordless vacuum. Well, I'm in my kitchen now and I've just emptied the contents of the V6 bin onto my kitchen floor and I've attached the fluffy head. So I'm going to see if I can clear up this. I've left it in quite a pile. I've not spread it about. Let's see if this fluffy head can remove all this dirt without snow plowing it. Well, yes, oh, I was going to say it's a clean sweep until I lifted up the head and a few bits dropped out. Let's just pick those up now. And finally, just to end this mini review, we'll test the pet hair pickup of some upholstery. So I've just groomed my daisy here with the Ferminator and she should have left quite a load of hair on this footstool so we'll see if the mini motorised head can remove it all. It's made a very good job. So if you're a pet owner, this machine does very well at removing pet hair from your upholstered furniture. And finally, I've just emptied the hair from the bin onto the carpet. So let's see how the regular carpet nozzle does at removing it.
Well, on carpets, it's pretty effective at removing the pet hair as well. So all in all, I highly recommend this cleaner, especially at 200 pounds. As I said earlier, it's a Witch Best Buy, and if you search online, you'll see many four and five star reviews for this product. It picks up very well on carpets and hard floors, it tackles pet hair, and all in all, it's very light and easy to use, and the emptying system seems very clean and efficient. If you have any questions about this Dyson vacuum cleaner, please comment below, and don't forget to subscribe for more vacuum cleaner reviews and demonstrations. So until the next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.